And now, your local weather authority forecast. Clouds are on the increase across the region, but for now, skies still mostly clear from clouds this morning in Midland and Odessa. And this is a live look. At the tall city, we have a good look at the Wilco building. The dark sky is still indicating mostly clear skies for our south. We're under night vision. We're seeing the black, white, and gray colors. Satellite and radar showing plenty of the whites and the grays, indicating more clouds moving from west to east. Very high up, very thin in the atmosphere. But those clouds will also start to lower closer to the ground, indicating more moisture in the atmosphere. For now, the clouds near Carlsbad, the Van Horn region, down to the Davis Mountains in the southern and western part of the Big Bend region of our viewing area. In the eastern part of our viewing area, skies mostly clear from clouds, but those clouds moving from west to east, and we'll likely see more of those clouds later today. Current air temperature sitting right around the 46 degree mark. This model depicting 48 in Midland, lower 40s, upper 30s in northern areas. The basin from Hobbs, Andrews, and Summer La Mesa, and to Snyder. It's a bit chilly this morning into the Marfa Plateau, into Alpine and Fork Stockton. Temperatures also in the high 30s, 40s, and low 50s. A little bit warmer in Alpine and Fork Stockton compared to Marfa. Warming up this afternoon, pretty similar compared to the past few days in the 60s, 70s, and low 80s, upper 60s, lower 70s in the mountains, mid to upper 70s along I-20, low 80s once again in Terrell County. So another repeat in terms of the temperatures, maybe a little bit cooler compared to yesterday for some of y'all, but temperatures will still be close to 10 degrees above normal for the summer of year. Mostly clear skies, 46 officially at the airport in Midland. A little bit more humid this morning, 79% relative humidity. East northeasterly winds at seven miles per hour as opposed to the westerly winds of yesterday. So those easterly winds bring in more humidity, more low level moisture. 5 to 10 to close to 15 mile per hour sustained winds right now. And then those winds will shift a little bit more from the south southwest today. Stronger winds in these blue and yellow colored areas in the Guadalupe Pass to Carlsbad with winds gusting close to 30 close to 40 miles per hour in the extreme higher terrain. Mostly cloudy today, but likely rain free for most of the day. High temperature 76 winds from the south southwest right around 5 to 15 miles per hour. But again, a little bit more humid out there. We'll see a slightly higher chance for rain as clouds move from west to east. They'll thicken up. But despite that, throughout the afternoon, we won't be seeing any rain until later this evening into the early overnight. Near I-20, near Midland, Odessa, but more likely near Big Spring and along I-20 toward Abilene. Not only rain showers, rumbles of thunder, highlighted by those greens and yellow colored areas. Leftover showers in the Davis Mountains extending into eastern areas of the basin late tonight into tomorrow morning. But likely rain free for most of the basin overnight, despite all this kind of weather pattern changes that will come into fruition and cloudy in the 60s overnight. Very mild winds from the south southwest right around 5 to 15 miles per hour. Tomorrow we may be seeing that slight chance for early morning rain showers, but sunnier later in the day. High temperature 76, low temperature 54 degrees. Your minor wash, car wash, seven day forecast showing mid 70s today and tomorrow afternoons. And then clear skies with lower temperatures as we spring forward this weekend.